i-google mo sis. There will always be people who'll comment, i-google mo on social media posts where somebody's asking about something. Now this one comment is enough to make the person behind the post feel stupid, annoyed, or regret posting altogether. Now I get that. But let me play devil's advocate for a bit. As a freelancer, knowing your way around the internet is definitely a must. You'll surely encounter tasks and situations you aren't familiar with. And in such a case, remember that Google is your best friend. More often than not, the answers you're looking for are just few clicks away. It's just within your fingertips. So yes, commenting Google mo can come across harsh, but it doesn't mean that it's entirely wrong. However, when we come across an obvious question around social media, I think it also helps that we put ourselves in the position or in the shoes of the person asking, the person behind the post. Because they might need some insights from fellow freelancers with first-hand experience on the matter or some support from the community they trust. Maybe they got even more confused when they search the internet for answers. Information overload as they say. Now what I'm saying is that one should do their own research first before asking any questions. But I think there is definitely no harm in being kind to one another in such an independent industry like ours. Do you agree? If yes, feel free to share and like and continue to follow Moms at Work for your regular dose of freelancing tips and tricks. And also, comment below your questions or suggestions and we will try our very best to answer that in the next video. I think that's it for now. Much love, Moms.